Hey guys, welcome back to the Ultimate Sim. I'm Landros. Now, Lacey just lost the first case that I came and did this with her. Um, it's 5 o'clock in the morning, and I'm sure she's exhausted. Ah, she's not too bad. Anyway, I have her going through and suing again. So, I don't know. She might make it, she might not. Now, apparently, this guy's up, but I had told him to go to bed, <clears throat> and he chose not to. So, I'm going to send him back off, let him go to bed. What are you doing up out of bed? Oh, you have really no reason to be in bed. <coughs> I'm going to have her, since we're here in this room, go ahead and use this bathroom and take care of herself. Uh, let's see, your husband is up now. Let's go ahead and use this one. Um, you guys got up really early, probably because I sent you to bed too early. That's okay. I mean, it can be worse. <coughs> when you get up, which shouldn't be too much longer, hopefully she's going to be out of here by the time you're ready to do this. I'm going to get you taken care of, and you, and it's going to be pushing it, because you're really close. As far as the job, you go to work in three hours, so let me get you taken care of real quick. You're the first one that has to go. Um, you're working, but not till later. You, I think you do not work today either, so pretty much all you guys are just home, <laughs> doing nothing. All right, Christopher, when you finally get up, which is going to be a while, we'll get you to take care of yourself. And then <clears throat> let's get you fed. That should take care of everybody for the most part with what they need for that. Um, Lacey's the one who's really going to need a little bit more work. Let's see, become friends with Hal. you got a lot of people you want to be friends with because of this stupid scandal thing, which has messed me up. <clears throat> Not really, but... It's just aggravating. It happens too often. Not really. I'm just complaining. I'm just griping. <clears throat> I know better. <clears throat> okay, well, when she finally gets out of here, hopefully she will do well enough. We can be done with this. Um, I know you want to learn the drums, and I'll lock it in. We're not going to actually have a bachelor party because <clears throat> I just don't think it's going to matter. Um, I think what I'm going to have you do instead... Let's just really push this guitar and logic right now. So I'm going to have you perform a few of these. Hopefully get this done before anything else happens. <clears throat> All right. You're good. You, uh, you probably won't have enough time to eat. Then again, you probably will do it anyway, even though I don't want you to. <clears throat> I mean, I want you to, but I don't think you're going to have time. George Peters is somebody new that the game has created, so I have no idea. Unless you guys know of him, but... Oh, man, she lost again? No. Okay, that was the first time. All right, I was going to say, don't lose again. Watch her, watch her did lose again. She did! <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. All right, come on home. I don't really care. Um, who did you want to become friends with? I know George Dean was one of them. I think Billy was one of them. Um, let's make Billy first. Apparently, Billy aged up overnight. Um, because his picture's not showing up. <clears throat> I'm really upset with her. I mean, I'm not upset with her. I'm upset for her, I should say. Uh, that's just awful. You know, she didn't do anything wrong, and it's now cost her two court cases. I mean, it'd be okay if she had done it, but she didn't. And that just should not have happened. All right, go ahead. He just wants to be friends. And who's this other one you want to be friends with? Shirley. All right, well, we'll get you home and let you become friends with Shirley. And then we'll let you eat. <clears throat> um, angel food cake. No, 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 not the angel food cake. You get the life fruit pancakes. <clears throat> and when you are done, I'm not going to make you go to sleep either. I'm going to let you go ahead and just take one of these potions. Just because... It is not fair. You lost your whole night because of that. You really did. She lost the whole evening for that stupidity. Send a text to Billy. You could. That would be easy points, I guess. If he'll show up. He won't. Um, let's just do a friendly text and get that out of the way. <clears throat> Alright, there's a pit sim fest going on. I'm not planning on going. Um, let's see. Lacey... Shirley, where are you at, Shirley? All the way down in the S's. Okay, there you are. 
And where is... Okay, she's right in front of me. I'm like, where are you? Anderson, you... Um, don't really need to do anything, do you? Yes, you do. Get over here and tend to your garden. Whatever you need to do. Christopher, sleep. Just enjoy your sleep. I'm not going to stop you. <clears throat> okay, I think she went to work. I'm only... Nope, she didn't. And you are not late yet. You got four minutes. Where are you at? Are you going to make it? No. <clears throat> and why don't you have clothes yet? You just got a promotion yesterday. You should have gotten a new outfit. Let me see. Do you have... Let me change your outfit if, if it'll let me. Career... You're in it. It's the only one you got. Get a better outfit. <laughs> I need you to wear something different. <clears throat> okay, for you... Um, why don't you use the workout facility? Let's get that going. And I don't know how much this potion is going to do for you. Um, maybe it'll be decent. Maybe it won't. <clears throat> okay, that's not bad. When you finish up... Um, I guess what we need to do is go ahead and get you out of here. Let's get you to go sue again. Let's see if you can't turn it, turn it around. <clears throat> I hate it. I hate that you have to do this. <clears throat> you are actually doing a great job, but you go in six hours. <clears throat> Hang out. Do what you're doing. You're fine. When you get finished, let's go ahead and listen to Logic again. I have no idea what you're up to. It doesn't look like you need anything from me, though. I think you're fine. Are you going to lick that plate? No, good. Very good. <clears throat> you are... Yeah, you need some social. But for right now, I really just want to get this slander thing out of the way. That'd be the best thing. I don't want three days of this garbage. <clears throat> it's not really affecting your mood. It's just when people see you in town... They're going to start booing you, and you're going to constantly get this harassed moodlet, which combined, it's going to eventually hurt, but I don't know. It really is not that big of a deal. Dimitri is up to level 7 in guitar. Wow. He's moving pretty fast on that guitar. I'm not complaining. Don't get me wrong. I'm not complaining one bit. Yeah, that's a bedroom right there in that <clears throat> little room. <clears throat> it's weird. Strange house. <clears throat> I, I liked it because I had aliens and nobody, only one person had to sleep when I was played with Brandon, Brandon but, you know, this family, I, there's no way I could do that. No way at all. <clears throat> See, I'm supposed to be working on the guitar thing. It's not something I can do right now because of this. This garbage. That's why we're glad we have potions. We can kind of compensate for that. <clears throat> Amy had a stressful day. Well, Amy, you know what? You did have a stressful day. Why don't we do this for you? When you get out of work, let's take you over here, and I'm going to get you... I'm not going to get... Yeah, I am. I'm going to get you the full uh, spa package. Why not? You've worked hard. <clears throat> let's see. What is this? Procure a portrait of self. I've never seen that one before. All right. Your mom can do it. Your dad could probably do it. <laughs> Look at him over there in the hot tub. What's broken? Okay, well, we got to go fix that. Um, since you've got the wish to do it, and it's over there broken, nobody can use it. Why don't you go ahead and fix it? I'm sorry to get you out of there. I know you're enjoying it, but... Um, Anderson, why don't we get you taken care of, too? Yeah, I know you don't have to go anywhere, but... Why don't you come on down... Actually, why don't you, while you're up here, use the bathroom? <clears throat> that would help a little bit. <clears throat> Is he going to work anytime soon? I guess not. I think this one's empty, so I should be able to plant something if I wanted to. I'm not planning on it, but I could. All right, come on down here and woohoo with your husband. <coughs> your husband. He has nothing in his inventory to worry about. Please win. Please do whatever you got to do and win. I don't really care, but <clears throat> I want you done. 
That is so weird. You're back in this crazy man outfit. <laughs> you are. Did you not fix it? I thought you did. Yeah, you did. <clears throat> okay. So weird. Um. All right, so Tatiana's getting together with somebody. She's going to be gone pretty much the whole day and night, so I don't have to worry about her for a while. Dimitri, you, um, you got time. You got three hours. I really wanted you to work on the guitar, but if you want to work on this too, that's fine. You've done well enough. I don't really have to worry. If you look at where you're supposed to be and where you are, you're good. Um, she's the one I really want to work on, and if I can get this taken care of, I'll be very happy. Come on, Lacey. Win this stupid court, court case. This is your third time. Mm, nope. Sorry. Look at these people down here. Norman and Susie. Oh, they just got married, too. <laughs> so that's nice. They do their own thing without us, so that's great. Okay, Dimitri's up to logic of four. Good for him. <clears throat> Is he old? He looks pretty old. Well. Come on. Come on, Lacey. This is it. I'm not doing this a fourth time, am I? Please tell me I'm not. <clears throat> I really don't want to do that for you. You should be able to get it. <laughs> Go again. Go do it again. Do it right. Get a better lawyer. Come on. That is pitiful. Okay, well enough of that let's see you what did you want to do you want to go back to the hot tub mm, actually Dimitri you gotta go to work I think he wants to go up and paint something but Anderson's painting instead so I'm letting them kind of figure out their own things they do what they want to do I'll go with Dimitri since everybody else is kind of on their own change into your clothes all I ever see you in is what you were going to bed in look at her Antoine Kyle paparazzi poor thing He's that old and he's still working. I'm so sorry. Alright, I'm going with Dimitri because there's really nothing else to do. I know you know everybody and there's really not much else you can work on, but let's do the music theory that helps your logic. And Don... Don went military? Okay. I usually send him into politics, but that's because I get his charisma skill up really high. That's just me. Or I sometimes put him in business and uh, that's about it. I don't ever send him off to the military, though. <clears throat> okay. Um, you're good. She's working. She's almost out. Oh, you guys live, work almost across the street. There is a place back here in the back that you can come over here and grill out. I never really noticed that until here recently, which is pretty cool. <clears throat> Not that I've ever, I've never done it, but you could. Please get a better outfit. I'm sick and tired of that. I know you can fix it. I know you can go in and change it. So if, if I have to, I will. But I was hoping they do it on their own. <clears throat> I wonder if somebody bought my old house. This is the house that I lived in with Brandon. I loved that house. It was fun. Yep, somebody's living there. The Ivanovs. Good for them. All right, please get this thing done and do it right. <laughs> These two guys, they are just... Go get a room. <laughs> Go somewhere else. Alright, Christopher, you're still rocking. Um, nope, you're not yet, but you're trying to. Why don't you go to the bathroom before you sit down? This thing, hang on. Yeah, too late. <laughs> I wasn't fast enough. Go there, do that. Anderson, um, no. If you're going to do something, you're going to complete it. Finish it. Nope. Okay, Amy. Oh, you got that for a little bit more than half. Please tell me you got this. Do I have to do this a fifth time? Oh my god. <laughs> Go again. <laughs> this is all you're ever going to do. This whole day is just... We spent more money on this stupid lawsuit for something we didn't do. <clears throat> That's just wrong. <laughs> There should be some kind of a law. Uh, oh, well. 
It's fine. We'll do it. We got the money. I just hate that she has to keep wasting her entire day of getting nothing done with her. Not that I really have to, but... Oh, wait. I wanted to put this out. Let's see. We went through winter. And we should have had... Let's see, is that spring? Yeah, that was our spring. And then here is our other winter. Or our summer. I'm sorry. Um, stop it. You're in my way. <laughs> You're right there. I could put it right there in front of you. I don't think you'd like me to do that. Actually, that was kind of decent in that spot. Let's put it right there on the corner. All right, so we got our pictures out. Everybody else can sell their pictures off if I want to. Her award, these are the things that go in the trunk that were for the family. Um, originally, it was going to be something different, but I think this is... That's gnomes. Okay, well, you know what? You can go in there. <clears throat> and I know I have another gnome somewhere. But this was the family one. And I don't think I put anything else in there except for her stuff. And, well, I put in her husband, the queen and the king of the dance. So I guess I could put it all in there if I wanted to. All right, go play in the contest when you're done. Um, mm, nothing else, right? I don't think I want to get rid of the rest of this. Okay, Christopher, I really got to get you out of this. This is this is weird. Let's just put this on instead. I don't care. It just looks strange to me. Um, whatever you want to do is fine. I'm just letting you just do your own thing. Oh, look. Elaine and Sherman got married. Um, okay. I don't think I know them. <clears throat> I really don't. Okay, you are... You're gone. You're gone. You're doing this. I could send the old people out to eat. Are they all hungry? Pretty much. Let's go out and eat. Come on. Get out of the house. Let's go to the diner. Go where you work. Why not? Let's go ahead and get them out. Otherwise, we go stir crazy. There's nothing for them to do. Uh-oh. George Steen's going to be a dad. Well, that's good. Normally, he lives in my town and dies single and alone and no... No descendants. <clears throat> Christopher was ready. He's like, I want to go. I want to get out of the house. That's fine. We're going. We're taking our time, but we're going to get there. Please get this done. You know, I'm just going to assume that she's going to do it. I'm not even going to bother. I'm not going to look at it. I just get this feeling she will do it this time. Yeah, right. <laughs> we're, we're trying to be optimistic. <laughs> we're just failing miserably. Um, yep, they got married. That's good. Oh, spotlight mushroom. I could have gotten it. <laughs> oh, man. I just want to just scream sometimes. If it wasn't funny, I mean, it is, it is typical. This is the whole point of playing with celebrities, so you have these kind of stupid things happen. All right, Anderson, you get to go do this next. Um, looks like she won. Yep, she did. Took long enough. Because you were woohooing with an occult. Um, no, you weren't. Oh, technically she is. Um, she's an imaginary friend. So, yeah, I guess she kind of did do it. Can't be too upset. But you did it in the privacy of your own home. So, come on. What's the point? All right, you are going to... She's doing her guitar opportunity. Again, I don't know how many she's done, but I figure we might as well just try to get as many done as we can. Dimitri should still be in there working, so that's fine. You... Man, stick around. Okay, you got to stay late tonight, buddy. All right, so I'm back with the old people. <laughs> that's all I can do. <clears throat> Not much else going on. It's just kind of... This is the game. This is what you do. You just kind of wait till they get through and try to try to get your goals accomplished. And so far, we haven't done much. <laughs> we really haven't. Um, yeah, what I'm doing right now with Lacey is kind of kind of help us in the long run, but not nearly what I really wanted to get done for her. The rest of these guys, um, I don't know, I'm just kind of waiting. Well, why don't you guys just head on to the house since it's raining? There's nothing else you want to go do, is there? I know you got to go do that. <clears throat> so, Christopher, oldest living sim, 
142 days old. If you hit 180, <laughs> I'll be amazed. I'm, I'm thinking there's something wrong that he's glitched out or something and that that's why it's not killing him off. I might be wrong, but I really don't think so. I think there is a mistake with him because I've never had a sim live this long past their time. Ever. <laughs> Ever. But he never did go anywhere with us for any reason. He never went to any of the countries. He didn't travel. Um, I can't think of anything that would have actually caused him to get all messed up. So, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Uh, Odin wants to ask Allie out. No, she's not going with you. There you go. That's the way you tell him. Um, can you get this? Go get the mail. <clears throat> and Dimitri, you're not out there yet. You, Amy, you're about to come home. Well, good. At least you got all your needs taken care of, except for somewhat being tired, but you're not really that tired. You need a painting for yourself. Um, I'd rather just ask Ally or Lacey to do it. I really would. Um, Hal, your partner's attracted to you. That's never a good sign. <laughs> That's never good when you're married. Okay, so you guys do what you have to do. Okay, so you got this one done. Um, you got second place for this competition. Fantastic. <laughs> All right, we are good. Um, that's the one you want. And this is the hardest one because, like I said, it's busted in the game. So you can't really do anything. What did you eat? What did you just eat? <clears throat> I hope it was one of these, but I know it wasn't. Hello. Hello. Who are you? Are you our father-in-law? I don't remember. <clears throat> I think he is. <clears throat> But anyway, so she's got two of the um, guitar challenges done. We now just have to work on the third. No. Does she have two of them done? I thought she did. Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, she's got two done. So now we just have to earn 25000 in tips. Well, the only way I know how to do that easily, and um, <clears throat> it's not that. It takes time. It's very time consuming. You can go out there and do it now and just have her start listening or playing for tips. I don't recommend it because it's just a waste of your time. However, let's do this. Let's go ahead and why don't you have your husband? Where's he at? <laughs> of course he is. <laughs> all right, of course. Um, are you hungry at all? I think you just ate, so you're not hungry. Why don't you come on in here and go to the bathroom real quick? <laughs> Let me see. Eh, stop it. And then when you get done, I'm going to have you woohoo with your wife just because this will help her with her social which is going down <clears throat> oh Yuri just became an elder we just saw him too bad um, mm. Aiden Jones Marisol's gone Aiden's an elder that's sad <laughs> it's always sad to see him age up like that Dimitri you spent all that time at work and all you made was 200 not real impressed. <laughs> it's okay, but it's fine. Um, at least you got a promotion, so that's good. That is really good. Uh, what is she going to go do? I'm not stopping her. Yeah, I'm not stopping her, but I should be. <laughs> Yuri retired. See, everybody tends to retire. Oh, man. No, that's Amy, so it doesn't matter. You can you can lose your, t your status. <laughs> Okay, Dimitri, when you get home, get I know you're tired. Dog. Do I have you jamming? No, come home. Flourish. Flourish. Idiot. Oh, it's already midnight, or almost midnight. Let's get you home. Get you here. You, you're going off to bed. You need the bathroom. Um, go use the bathroom. Go to bed. You're not really tired. You really aren't. But you are. Oh, you broke it. <laughs> All right. Well, you got something to do. Come on. I'm giving you a job. I tell you. And you don't ex You don't appreciate it, do you? All right, that did not work on your social as much as I wanted it to. So, why don't we tell him an inside joke? Tell a funny story. 
I just want to get that up so I can not have to think about it. <clears throat> All right, that does not do it either. Um, ask him about his day, what he did, nothing. <laughs> he did nothing at all. He really didn't. And then chat with him a little bit. Okay, Anderson, you're done. Why don't we get you up here to, hang on, I can't find it. Go to the bathroom, and then you go to bed. These guys are going to be up for a while. Arna, Nikaya Janzo, mm -hmm. Viv. Cool again. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Take another round. You guys are all sleeping, so... Yeah, the whole house is pretty much asleep, so we're okay. Um, so this is making you a nerd. Eh, it's alright. Um, okay, so they moved. That's good. We should have been on our second husband by now. <laughs> we really should have. I don't understand this. Why won't this man die? <laughs> it's just too much. Yeah, I could kill him, but I'm not going to. See, that should be Christopher coming back from the dead. But, no. And I've looked. He doesn't have anything in there. I looked through um, the mod. There's nothing that's actually stopping him. He should be able to die. But apparently, he's just very lucky. I know that's the way the game is set up. It basically, you get a chance to die every day. It rolls a chance for you. And if you slip past it, then you can live for a lot longer. And he doesn't have the challenges done, does he? No. So I don't get him. I really don't. I've had some Sims that have been athletic, have done everything, achieved everything, and they die on like day 91, 92. And not this one. <laughs> you buddy, you can't earn a raise. You gotta go to work first. Okay, with her, nope, I don't want you working out. Get over here. Nope, nope, nope. Stop, stop, stop. Would you stop? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Gosh, for some reason, my mouse will not work. Okay, stop that. Hate that. Um, let's get you over here to perform since it doesn't look like you want to sleep right away I'm gonna let you perform at least twice and then I'll send you off to bed so I can say I got something done today stop it stop it stop <laughs> I hate that uh, every time I turn around she wants to work out okay which after Twinbrook she can work out all she wants I don't care but right now I don't want that <clears throat> Christopher, um, why don't you just go ahead and get some sleep? Let's go up to bed. Come on, buddy. It's late. Who's bothering us at 2 o'clock in the morning? You don't see me coming to your house, do you? No, I don't even know where you live. That's pretty. Um, who is George Peters? Where do you live, buddy? Oh, okay, he's got this house. This isn't a bad house either. It's actually a decent house for a pretty nice-sized family. Um, is it, or maybe it's this one, or it might be that one. I don't remember. I can't remember, but one of these houses is actually pretty good. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and let her finish up these two um, performances, let her go to bed, and then when we come back, we'll see what we can do for Wednesday. Oh. Wow, I thought it was already Thursday. All right, I'll be back oh. in just a second. All right, well, it looks like a lot of them are getting up at this point. Um, Amy got up really early, and I'm having her finish up. I'm going to let her go take a little bit of a nap before she has to go to work. Just, I mean, she doesn't really need to, but, you know, she got up super early, so I figured why not. Dimitri's off for the day, so I have him set up to do some more of these performances to kind of practice up. Um, yeah, he's got the baked angel food cake, so he's fine. Um, Allie got up. She really didn't have anything else to do, so I'm just letting her clean herself up go down here and get something to eat and then at this point she needs to work on her relationship with some of her co-workers and her boss that's really been pretty bad but I don't think I have social networking for her at all not much and I could let Lacey do it for her if I wanted to Anderson's the one who did not win his case I don't even think he went and tried so he still has to go over and do that he does work later on nope two more days so he's fine so I'm going to let him go get this stuff taken care of and then go sue for slander and see if he can get it done. With Lacey, I have pretty much set her up for everything she's going to need. And with Christopher, well, nothing. So let's get Christopher going. Buddy, I'm going to have you go ahead and come on down and I'll have you eat something first. Let's see. 
And once you're done with that, you can go ahead and let's see, go to the bathroom. Um, there's not much else I really want you to do. To be honest with you, you're kind of. I expect you to be gone. <laughs> That's the sad truth. Um, maybe I'll let you just go ahead and tend the garden. Why not? And if you need to, then you can take a shower again. So that gives you a purpose. All right, you cannot earn a raise no matter what you try. Um, you, you could meet somebody new. I don't know if you will, but you could. You've got too many other things I want you to get done. Um, you are up finally. I don't want you oversleeping, and I think you probably will if I don't get you up before work. I think her carpool comes at 8, so once it comes, I will actually stop her and let her get up and go. I just figure she's always the one that's tired first, so I figured let's go ahead and get her taken care of now, and then that way, at least tonight, she won't be in such a bad position. Why don't you guys use the right door? I guess I should lock it to where you guys can't use that door, and then you'll probably start going through the other one. Um... Not that it really is that big of a deal, but... Or, change it so that the door is here instead of in between. I could do that. Alright, you gotta go. See, I told you you'd oversleep. Go! <laughs> Get up! Please change into the right clothes. Please change into something better. I don't know you won't, but... Ah. <laughs> it's just frustrating. I don't know why she's wearing that, but... She should have already changed into something from the police, the law enforcement career, but she didn't. Uh, Alright, buddy. You, I, I do have you set up, don't I? I don't have you set up to do the bathroom, but I think you'll be fine. So you should be good. Anderson, you gotta go. It's time for you to get up, get out of here, sue, get this done. Uh, is nobody gonna clean up this house? Um, guess who's got a job? <laughs> Come on down here and clean up. Uh, get out of the chair. Are you up yet? My goodness. And you never get a full energy. No matter what you do, you never can get it because you were a werewolf. I hate that. Wish I could fix it, but I can't. I don't know how to fix it. Um, oh, that's why you do it so fast because you're virtuoso. I got you now. I didn't even look at it, didn't even think about it. I guess it didn't hit or register that that's what you had. Um, oh cool, somebody brought in free donuts. Good for them. Where are you going now? <laughs> Back to the chair. <laughs> All right, go to the chair. You got nothing to do. You got nothing but time, 143 year old, day old, whatever. <laughs> No mail, right? I don't think there is. Oh, yeah, there's mail. <laughs> I love when you gripe and complain. I do. Okay, Lacey, get up. It's time. It's past time. You slept later than anybody. Although I did keep you up pretty much all night. I did. That was bad. Okay. Um, so, yeah, I don't really have much for her to do except for this guitar thing which is going to be her main focus, so we'll continue on it and see if we can get it to work, but it just takes a while. But once you get it to where she's performed several times, then you go down and perform for tips, we'll make that 25000 really, really fast. It's, it's definitely worth it. So I'd love to play a game just as a person who lives off the, um, the money they make off their guitar. If you play it in Bridgeport, it's super easy. You can get that done with no big deal. But if you play in other towns, it's not quite as easy. But you can do it and make good money. I think when Brandon hit Barnacle Bay is when we really were focusing on the guitar. I pushed, I kind of held off on it until then. Since that's when he started working, I believe the music career was there. And let me tell you, he made a ton of money off of that. All right, are you done? Mm. When you get done with this, why don't you go ahead and use that one? Um, everything else is good. You're not working, so you might as well just take care of a few things. I don't know why I'm making you do this, except for the fact that, you know, it's... If you're going to learn the skill, this is probably the better thing to do. And, of course, you're going to go down here and play computer games. You should be calling your boss or somebody and just starting to build your relationships up a little bit. 
Look at that. Call this guy. Call him. Call her. And is there anybody else you can call? No. That'll give you something to do. At least I, I think it will. Okay. You in that stupid outfit. <laughs> You're really aggravating me. You know that? What's broken? What's broken? The umbrella? Now where is he going? He was all upset. He had to go. Came in so quickly. Well, at least you have something to occupy your time. You can come watch him. <laughs> watch him play. All right, you, I didn't actually tell you to do anything different at work, but I think you're doing what you need, so that's fine. We got logic done, so we're good. Um, how close do we have to be? Oh, we're good. <clears throat> See, he got it done one time. That aggravated me. <laughs> you have no idea how much that aggravated me. Uh, it's okay. I'm glad he's done. And there's still mail. Still, um, Christopher, time to go. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's time for you to go. Oh, man. I think I've almost gotten it. Oh, man. See, Billy was one that I was thinking to go after, and now he's got a kid. Oh, well. And Billy's old, didn't he? Let's go find him. Billy. <laughs> Is this where you live now? Why are you here? Because this is not your house. Um, I don't know. Anyway, I kind of figured that if by the end of the week, if maybe no, nobody's taking a date. If um, Christopher is still here at the end of Saturday, we're going to go ahead and have a kid with Christopher. Just because, really, we're going to run out of time. And not so much, but... It takes you about two weeks to actually raise a child from conception all the way up to where they can go to school. And I don't want her trying to do that while we're trying to level up the part-time job. Because, you know, that one, we're only going to be doing it for two weeks. So, if he's still here, he will become a father for a second time. But, if he's not here, and she can't find anybody that fast, then we'll probably go ahead and um, adopt. At least that's what I'm thinking. Because you have to adopt at least sometime during the challenge. But I'm kind of hoping that the man finally just decides to kick the bucket. But <laughs> and I know that's awful to say, but it's time. <laughs> it really is. This kid may die before he does. Actually, he won't. He's got ten more days until he's even at risk. And I don't think you can both be in the chair. Oh, wait. Of course you're going to the hot tub. <laughs> of course you are. I like it. Um, really, there's nothing else you guys can do. I'm going to let you just do what you're doing. As far as her times, how many times has she performed this? Because kind of keep an eye on it. She has done this 11 times. It's You need to go a lot more than that. So I just have her just keep doing it, keep playing it as many times as you can a day. And then that way, by the time you do get to the point where you need it, you're good. Um got athletic up to five that's great um, got you we knew that I have nothing for you people to do nothing well actually I do and I'm doing it but I was kind of hoping that you know he was gone and we could start moving forward with other things no I'm making the meat a little bit earlier than what they normally would want to eat just because I want to get rid of some of this food. Um, where are you at? Why are you going to go look at the windows? You're weird. <laughs> He's a weird man. Alright, so our maid is there. She is working. I do see it, but... No, if we eat this food up, then we won't have to deal with it. Dimitri, you got one more of these to do, and then I'm going to let you eat. Um, Alright, and then what's this? Learn a new composition. I have one for you to learn. Since she already knows them all, I can actually give it to you. We got three of them for you, buddy. And then you can do that. Actually, I think... Did I give you this one? Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I don't know. Nope, I didn't. Alright. Did I give you... 
Uh, I think I gave them, give them all to you. Actually, I'm going to give them all to you just because if you haven't done them, then you can pass them on. But she doesn't need any of them, so might as well. All right, she got a raise for something. Um, level three. Okay, this you want. Thousand. All right, we're getting rid of this. I do want somebody to take your picture or to paint your picture, so why don't we do this? Let's let Christopher <laughs> go up here. Let's scrap this one. Let's paint a portrait of. Um, she's not home yet. Get home. We need you here <laughs> so we can get this done. I think she's here yet. Is she? Come on. Man, it takes her a while to get here. Or maybe she's already here and I just didn't catch it. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> we'll find out. Amy, go ahead and take, do your portrait of Amy real quick. And then that way um, we can get that wish for her out of the way. And it gives you something to do. What are you doing? Get to know. All right. Stop everything you're doing. Stop, stop, don't, don't do anything. Because I know what you're going to want to go do. And I'm not letting you do it. Um, I forgot which one is the... What is that? What is performing? Oh, I should have done that one. I forgot which one is the one that actually is the fastest that you can perform. Um, I had it. I remembered there's one on the piano that goes so fast you can just sit there and you can do it repeatedly over and over and over. But these I don't know so much. All right, that should be enough. Would you get out of that? That's fine. I'll let you have the cap and gown. You can do that. I have no problem with it. It's not what I want, but, you know, would you say it's your graduation photo? And I'm not changing you back. You can stay in those clothes all you want. Look at me. There we go. Okay, so that will get her a portrait, and then we should be able to go. Listen to who? Your dad? What's he going to do? No. <laughs> I don't know. Well, why don't you go clean yourself up? Let's do this. Go over here. Go over here. Go eat. Um, and then if you want to, while you're here. See, now you've got clothes. I mean, I see this, so it does know that. How do I get rid of the cap and gown? I'm tired of wearing it or looking at it. Change it to career one. I want to see what you look like. And then you can read. So that may do it. Um, no. Not at all. I think it's because she got the promotion, so that's why it's doing it for her. Okay, when you get done, you know what you have to go do. You gotta clean yourself up, <laughs> of course. Um, let's go up here. You guys know I've forgotten all about the Tiberium, right? <laughs> I forgot we had it up here. And this one hasn't grown? Give me a break. Oh, I hate when it does that. All right, well, at least two of them have grown. The other one should have gone by now. That's just all kinds of wrong. All right, well, the other one was right there, so it should have grown. So I'm going to give it some time, see if it will. Um, okay. You're fine. Anderson. Dimitri. Yeah, that's fine. You can do this if you want. Because I know that's your lifetime wish, but I'd rather... Oh, you already know that one, don't you? You know that one. Uh, you already know all these? No. You can't know all those. Maybe you do. <laughs> Maybe so. Um, really, I... Uh, Alright, fine. I guess you knew them all. Why can you not perform that? Oh, because you're sitting down. Get up. Where did she go? What did you... I told you to do all this and you finished it already? I think you just lied to me and said you did. I think you did. Because I don't believe you did it that many times. I could check and see. Because originally you had 11, and I know you don't have that many. You did five. You didn't do, a, you didn't do as many as I li lined up for you. So stop lying to me. Um, 
Did you get credit for this? See, there you go. Now you're wearing what you should. Dimitri, um, sure. Go ahead and do some drinking. Do this a little bit. Oh, learn. Yeah, I want to learn. <laughs> I want to learn. Okay, so that's fine. That gives you something to work on. You, you're fine. I have nothing for them to do. I guess I could take them out, but it's summer. I mean, there's really not a whole lot else going on. I should get them out. No, it's fall. It's not summer anymore. There's really not a whole lot for them to go do. We need something. We need a place for them. Aiden Jones has a party. Anderson, go to the party. Let's see if you'll go. Oh, we will go. If it's decent, the rest of us will come too. What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? You have lost your mind. Go ahead and continue performing. I could go do this at the party, but I just want to see if the party's worthwhile. When I come back, you better not be working out. I'm telling you that now. Good lord. <laughs> How long is it going to take you to get there? <laughs> the party will be over by the time you make it there. Uh, somebody moved in over here. Oh, wait. I think somebody already still lived there. Well, at least the car's fast. The lessons are out, so we could have their house if we wanted. Uh, I was going to check this house. Is this house vacant? Yeah, it's still vacant. Where did the Jones live? Man. Oh, yeah, they're in this house. We like this house. Okay. Um, tell me who's here. Anybody worthwhile? <laughs> is it is it worth coming to? Ah, come on. I want to look at their house again real quick. See, they've got this little room over here, which would be great for uh, like a second bedroom or something. I could use it. Over here we have, hmm, no rooms, no bedrooms, I don't think, over in the, on the first floor. So... Well, turn on the lights, people. <laughs> it's dark in here. You can't see. Um, okay. Who's this guy? Go talk to him. Do you know him? Uh, be friendly and just go talk to him. Ask him about his day, whoever he is. Oh, it's Don. Um, let's see. Upstairs. You do have a couple of rooms. One, two. There's a third bedroom. There's a fourth bedroom. Well, one's not actually a bedroom. Um... And then there's this room upstairs, which is the, the party room, <laughs> which we liked. Um, I don't think there's a whole lot going on at this party. I really don't. Uh-oh. What's going on down here? Dallas and Hannah. Um, Hannah has somebody, Dallas. <laughs> and we're at his house. <laughs> I believe this is Aiden and Hannah's house. Okay. Don's a schmoozer. Yeah, I knew that. And charismatic and has commitment issues. We knew this. Nothing new here. Okay, you have fun over here. I'm going to go back and make sure. Look at this. You know, I tell you to do something and you don't do it. That means you get peanut butter and jelly and that you better like it. That's all you get. And why are you making food when there's plenty of food left? They're just wasteful people. <laughs> They're so wasteful. Okay, Amy, I know you're kind of tired, but not really. It's only 9.30. Do you work tomorrow? Yeah, you do. I'm not sending you to bed yet. I'm going to make you wait. Um, Hannah is... Oh, she just reselled her status. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Um, what else can you do besides play this guitar? Which you won't do for some reason. Perform this. Um... Perform that one. Yeah. Act like you're going to do what I tell you to do. Anderson, come home. <laughs> There's no reason to be there. There's nothing going on over there. Shirley's the elder. Everybody's an elder. Take him. <laughs> Take him now. <laughs> I'm tired. I would like for this to move on, but unfortunately, poor Christopher is just not ready to go. Oh, man. Um, Dimitri's doing postings? Okay. Well, why don't you go up and go take care of yourself? You're, you know what? You guys are old enough to figure it out on your own. I'm working with her, so she will always forget. Um, how many times are you going to do this? 
Billy's an elder. Okay, that's what I figured. I thought he was already an elder. Poor guy. Well, you were one of the ones that we were going to choose. Is this Billy? No, that's a Anderson. Um, you were one of them on the list, but apparently we're not going to get one because he's not giving it up. Go, go today. <laughs> Christopher, what are you going to go do? Sit in the chair? No, you're going to get in the hot tub. All right, well, if you get in the hot tub, we may join you. Why not? <laughs> All right, I hear you. And he's just going to stare out windows. They've all lost their minds. Every last one of them. Come on. And I'm sure he has a wish to actually... Nope, he doesn't. He does not have any wishes. Well, he's got the one about painting. Oh! I'm so sorry. <laughs> I feel horrible. I feel horrible because I told him to take him. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't want him to go now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Christopher, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I was meaning it just in jest. I didn't mean it for real. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. Oh, poor guy. Uh, he lived a very long time. Yeah, I was going to say, he should have like something even bigger than that. Oh, poor Christopher. Well, he had a very, very long and fruitful life. Believe me. You should shake his hand because you did well. There's no reason to beg. Don't beg, buddy. You don't need to beg. Oh, you had enough. Oh. Oh, that's so sad. That is so sad. Oh, oh that is terrible. Well... You knew it was coming, and it's been expected for a long, long time. But Christopher has finally passed on to the other side. Poor thing. Man, I didn't think that he was ever going to go. All right, we're going to put him out here for right now. We need to actually do something special for him because he lived a very, very long life. Poor thing. Now let's go take a look at you. <laughs> You're cleaning a toilet. <laughs> well, people handle their grief in different ways, don't they? Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, but you got two days of this being heartbroken. You didn't run out there to see it, though. I was surprised you didn't. I'm really surprised. What are you going to do? No, you're not going to go play computer games. You're really not. Um, why don't you come down here and mourn your husband? That might be a nice thing for you to do. <laughs> at least act like a grieving widow. <laughs> you may not really feel it, although you guys were really good together, so you should. And now you gotta do this. You could rant about death, but then you die tonight too. I don't really want you to die. Um, I'm really upset now. <laughs> I did not expect it. I was sitting there thinking, something's broken with him. We're gonna have him for a long time. He'll be with us in the next town. Nope. Guess that's over. So the game is not broken. He just lived 143 or 144 days. Yeah, there you go. That's what I thought. <laughs> you should be all upset and broken up. Go ahead and mourn again. And um, we need to actually... We need to go and line up our second husband fast because story progression will kill us. So... It will. All right, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and send them all off to bed, and then I'll be back in just a minute once we're actually up and ready to get going for Wednesday. So be back in just a second. All right, I'm just actually sending um, I'm sending Lacey out to go to the spa. She's going to get the um, the 7500 Simoleon soothing package. So I figured that would give her something. It will kind of help counteract. I mean, yeah, it's not like she's really hurting or anything, but you know, it'll help us to give us another counteract for this um, negative 25 for two days so just get her out she's got plenty of energy I had nothing else for her to do she wasn't gonna sleep so I figured let's just go ahead and do this now and um, that'll be fine but like I said we are gonna have to move fast for her next husband because with the story progression mod in the game every eligible single guy will be gone quickly and so I do want to push on that that'll be our first thing we're gonna work on tomorrow so 
don't be surprised if we have a, a new husband by tomorrow night or even tomorrow afternoon. Um, actually, be later than today. So, all right, everybody else is sleeping. I've got them all set up, so I'll be back once uh, it's time to get going with the next things for today. Okay, well, somebody's getting up. Um, Amy's getting up. So is Dimitri. Let's see. She's almost up. Uh, the main thing I really want them to do is get cleaned up, which is not too bad. Tell you what, why don't you stop here? Let's go ahead and woohoo with Dimitri. You'll take care of that need. And then I'm going to send you guys down in just a little bit to the festival because it's coming. Um, let's see. Dimitri was supposed to go to the bathroom, but it's all right. He's not too bad, though. She's still working over, or over at the spa, so I don't have to worry about her just yet. Um, Anderson was the last one in bed, so it took him forever to get there. Let's see. You guys, you're almost up, so you're fine. I would like to get you in the shower. Let's get you over here. So this one, and then Anderson, you should be able to use this one here. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, why don't you guys go on downstairs, get something to eat, so you're not just starving. Let's see. You go on down and get something to eat, too. I know you're hungry. And then you come on home. I know. You're all exhausted. You're tired. Not exhausted, but you're just upset. Oh, wait. She didn't She didn't rant or do anything about this. Uh, <laughs> so many things I got to do. All right. You're going to go rant about something. Rant about work. Um, that'll be fine for me. Okay. You're waiting on him. Good. You. Are you hungry yet? You will be by the time you get done. Trust me. You will be. And you probably will be, too. Okay, when they are done, I'm going to send them out, but I'm going to send them individually over to the festival. That way, maybe they'll stay and they won't have to do this breaking up with the group thing. So, let's just send them all over. Um, whoa, I didn't want to do that. Alright, go on down. Lacey, you don't even have to come home. Ah, uh, stop it. Why do I keep doing this? So, Lacey, don't even bother with coming home. Don't do it, don't do it. Just rant where you are and come over here. Just let me go find you. Oh, you're already there. <laughs> you're right there by the house. Okay, I think you should be able to actually stop it pretty quick. Did that do it? <laughs> sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Let's see what happens. There, it did it. All right, so that's it. You don't have to go through the whole ranting. You can just go for a little bit. All right, you guys coming yet? Not quite. Not quite. You are, you're already there. You're already there. As long as they're there, that's fine. We're just going to get the picture. Um, I believe... Yeah... I believe I know where we're going to go for the next for the next father, the next husband. And um, we should be right in the right spot. I would hope. We're going to find out. <laughs> we're going to find out real fast. Okay, so if they would get here, we could do the picture. And that would be nice to get it done. But she needs to go to the bathroom, so let's go ahead and get her upstairs. And the girl's bathroom is the second one. Oh, that sounded awful. Go ahead and use this bathroom. Okay. Nope. I don't see him. Okay. So, who are you? Oh, you're mine. <laughs> you're my kid. Um. Oh, I swear. I thought we were dying. It's like, not again. <laughs> not somebody else. All right, Amy, you're already up here. You went to the bathroom. Yeah, go watch him play. Um, who else is here? Anybody? Vladim. I'm looking to see if there's particular people. We are looking for a specific. Who are you? You're not mine, are you? No. That's Dimitri's family. Yep, there's Dimitri's dad. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> Everybody gets old. Go for it, Dimitri. <laughs> Make some money. <laughs> I don't think he's doing anything. Anderson's going to take forever. It takes him so long to get anywhere. Uh, you could have done this while you're waiting. Express the need for exercising. No, why don't you just go ahead and enter while we wait on Anderson to get here. That'll give you guys something to do. Um, but where are you going? Amy... Watch your fiance. I'd rather you do this. Watch him. And you. 
Oh, you took you took Christopher's car. <laughs> All right. Oh, how sad. That's such a sad song. <laughs> it's just a a bad day at the festival. <laughs> um, a little rough. Let's see. Is he here yet? No. Okay, get on the lot and then. Fantastic. Uh, you might do that. I don't really want you to. Buddy, that's a little loud. I gotta tell you. Alright. Anytime now. You guys can finish. Okay, are we guys done yet? Why don't you go to the... Go in here. You go in here. Actually, no. You're watching him, so you can stay watching him. You're playing. You're watching. Are you done? Okay, good. Take your photo with the remaining people in your family. That's so sad. That's <laughs> so sad. Okay. You should be stopping. <laughs> you should be stopping now. <laughs> He's not stopping. He won't quit. <laughs> he just won't stop. That's okay. And then in just a minute, we're going to head out of here. Um, Lacey is. The rest of them can stay and do it. As long as they all get in the picture, that's all that matters. I just want the photo. But then Lacey will be out of here, I'm hoping. I could have brought the Yuri, the other one people in there, but they're not part of the household, so they're part of the extended family. Oh, hush. <laughs> get in there. Okay, I should have five people in this in this photo. Let's see. Yeah, so sad over there by herself, but she won't be there for long. It won't be that way. Okay, you guys, you're all on your own. Lacey, I want you, let's go see if he's home. <laughs> you knew it was coming. All right, he's gone. Where's he at? Where's Don at? He's out at the moment. I know he's out at the moment. That's okay. She can call him. Let's go ahead and call this man. See if he'll show up. Oh, wait. Good. Let's actually invite him out. Oh, that didn't sound good. Bring him to you. I don't want to have to go find him anymore. All right, why don't you go ahead and console? Oh, okay, sure. Sounds fine. Can you console at all? Yeah, console her. All right, so that gives us something. Um, why don't you go over here so you're not just wasting time? <laughs> oh my! <laughs> I know, I know, it's awful, but I gotta, I gotta move quick if I'm gonna get you another husband. I really do, and I can't, I can't afford to waste time. What are you gonna go do with her? Hug? Oh, that was nice. That was nice of you. Your grandfather died, and your, your grandma was about to choose somebody else. <laughs> She's about to trade up again. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if it's a trade-up or not. All right, Don, come on over here, buddy. We want to talk to you. We want to ask about your day. Yeah, run after this man. Originally, I was going to go after Billy. That was who I was going to go after when Christopher died. Well, unfortunately, Billy, just before this, ended up getting a girl pregnant, and I don't want to break up a family with a newborn. I just... Uh, it's just asking for bad karma. I <laughs> just don't want to do it. So, um, I'm going to ask him. I know we've already looked at Let's find out about his degree. And let's find out if we go somewhere. Let's form a group. See if he'll do it. Um, yeah, whatever. <laughs> He's got a communications degree. Okay. That can work for us, hopefully. I don't know. I don't know what his job is. Oh, he's military. That's right. So that won't help us one bit. But he's kind of old, <laughs> to be honest with you. He's not the youngest guy in the world. Let's tell him a joke. Okay. Now, what we are going to do, now that we're in a group, we're going to pause, and we're going to go find a spot to take him. Which is very easy. We're going home. Um, let's go ahead and take him to the house real quick. And come on, buddy. You got to come with us. The nice thing is, don't go to his house if you want him. Um, well, you have, he's got a car, but it's a pitiful car. Anyway, if you take him off the lot, they'll bring their car with them. 
I sent you guys over there to stay there for a reason, but nah, you don't want to stay there. You want to go home. That's why I don't care. And she could get her car back now that Christopher no longer... Well, he wasn't using it anyway, so... I don't know, I've just kind of gotten attached to her in this van for some reason. Just because usually I never use it, and I figured, you know, I am going to get as much mileage out of this stupid thing as I possibly can. Uh-uh. No, 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 he's still there. <laughs> you can lie. You can lie all you want. I got hung up on something. No, you didn't. You're right there with me. Um, he better not disappear on me. If he does, I'll be upset. Come on. Come on in. Let's go ahead and ask. Uh, let's go ahead and let's. No, 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 no. Do this. Stop it. Where are you going? I will hunt you down. I will hunt you down like a dog. All right. I'm going to follow him. He's right here. <laughs> no, you're not working out. Don't even try it. Where did he go? Stop. Stop, stop, stop. I'm going to get lost. All right, because I'm worried about you, and you're driving me nuts. You are going to perform, and I'm going to find this guy. I'm going to follow him. He's probably going home. I think he's going home. Okay, I should probably just sent you over to his house anyway. Hey, what do you got going on at your house? Wait, where did his car go? <laughs> He's gone. He disappeared on me. All right, fine. Let's go see if he's here. Nope, he's not. Let's go ahead and call him and invite him out again. He probably will say no this time, jerk. <laughs> <laughs> you little jerk. Let's invite him over. He's probably going to say, no, I got something better to do. You can't do that. Don't do that to me. Sure, he'll come over in a little while. Now he's going to give us his message like, sorry, no, I can't. That's all right. You're coming. Let's go out here and get the mail. And let's wait. I know the walls are down. Um, let's see. Ask about. Oh. We will ask. I don't care, we'll break it up. <laughs> we will break it up. <laughs> he doesn't have kids, so I have no problem with that. All right, where's this guy at? I know you drive a little hideous car, but come on. It shouldn't take you that long. And I thought he was at the, um, whatchamacallit, the festival, because he used to have that job, but not anymore. All right. There we go. All right, now, here's what we're going to do. We are going to... Uh, chat with him real quick. See, you're not going to get away. Not that easy, buddy. I'm sorry. It's not, ha it's not happening that way. Um, do a friendly hug. Get to know, maybe. Go away. <laughs> Go away, paparazzi guy. Um, Let's see, anything else I want to do with you? Uh, you could brag, but I think that's going to hurt you. I really do. Let's sketch him, come on, why not? Okay. Um, Christopher, Billy... Poor Christopher's gone. <laughs> Sorry. He got gifts and he's gone. Um, I don't want to form a band. I want to do some of these ass things, but... I don't want to do the pillow fighting either, because sometimes that turns out bad. It really does. Come on. Ask to move in. There we go. Don, you're about to come join our household. I'm scared because story progression will kill us. I'm not going to make her get married right away just because, I mean, let's face it, she's still in mourning. <laughs> so <laughs> she's not that big a tramp. But we'll at least get him in here. Um, where he sleeps, I'm not quite sure. They can share a bed, I guess. I mean, they're not romantic yet. They're just friends. We'll find out just exactly how old he is because he is old. He's actually a mature adult, so... He may be becoming an elder in the next day or so, which is fine. I don't care as long as we can actually um, get her married and have another kid for Riverview, then we'll be good. 
we still need to have a funeral for Christopher, which I was going to do that, but I knew today wouldn't be the day to do it. So it's festival day, so we're not going to do that. But we could do that in probably tomorrow, maybe. No, Friday or Saturday might be a better day to do it when most people are off work. So, okay, ask him. <laughs> he better say yes. He's got commitment issues, which could hurt us. It could. It could be a bad thing. I didn't even see if he had a partner that we knew about. Does he? I don't know. Does he have a partner? Not that we're aware of. There you go. Yeah, I'll move in. You got a lot more money than I do. Okay, so there you go. And no animals, thank goodness. All right, so sell off your furniture. Come on over. We got husband number two on the line. <laughs> There's nothing wrong. Plus, I would rather her, um, I'd rather he ask her to marry her, marry him so that she gets his name. So that's the whole point of making the move in first. Otherwise, I could have just done the, you know, marry right away and be done. But now I'd like to actually go ahead and get that done. Yeah, he's old. <laughs> he's getting up there. Um, he's third in line, which is okay. That's fine. How is Amy the oldest? Because I thought Anderson was older than her. I think they're twins <laughs> for the most part. All right, buddy. Oh, <laughs> you got two days. You got two full days. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can't really change his age. I could, but I'm not going to. Um, I could do it. Let's see. Do you have your car? You do. And you can keep your car for now. Why not? Um, uh, let's go ahead and... Let's see. Ask her about her degree. And why don't we chat with her? Um, let's see. Mm, cheer her up. Which she's going to get all mad. Let's go ahead and console her. And what else can we do? Look at him. Um, do your friendly hug. It's your best friend. And he has done nothing with his life. <laughs> he's done nothing. Do you have... Oh, he does have a partner. He's got, he's got a girlfriend. He's a jerk. He's a jerk. And this is what he does. <laughs> he's going to break up with her with a text. <laughs> That's just how bad he really is. He's just a horrible man. But <laughs> we like him, so <laughs> we're going to keep him. That way she won't actually be upset with him when he does go after her, which I'm going to have him go pretty quick. In fact, he's going to be, he's going to compliment her personality a little bit. She probably won't like it. Yes, she will. She's, she's a tramp. <laughs> she is. All right. She's still thinking about her dead husband, but yeah, she got this one on the line too. Um... That's pretty bad. If your husband dies and you go on a date the next night. <laughs> Only in The Sims can you get away with this stuff. Okay. Um, Alright, so you actually have gotten a couple of celebrity stars. Why don't you go ahead and... Go ahead and give her an amorous hug. And while you guys are out, watch the stars. Why not? I wasn't going to do this for you, but... I'm not going any further than that. You're still going to just stay best friends. I'm not going to turn you into anything else, so you're done. Um, he's kind of tired, but not really. He's got to go to work tomorrow. She's kind of hungry. Is he hungry? No. So tell you what, why don't you go ahead when you're done, you go up here and go to bed. You go in here and go to eat. <laughs> go, go to eat. Go eat. Um, let's see. Life fruit pancakes are good. You should have eaten too. Um, yeah, you're hungry. Everybody's hungry. Uh, what about you? Yep, every single one of you. Nobody ate. Alright, so that gets everybody fed. And then it's 9 o'clock. You don't really need to go to bed this early. So, I'm not going to make you. Um, you're kind of tired, though. He's the only one who has to get up early because he's got to go. He's military. Which is ridiculous. Now his lifetime wish he will not get done. To be a heartbreaker, not gonna happen. Did he break up with her? Um, I assume he did. 
And I assume she now hates him. <laughs> oh, yes, she does. Oh, that killed it. Okay. So she doesn't like him at all. But at least that way he won't be he won't be bad and we won't have to worry about the scandal all the time happening, which is what would happen. Okay. As far as skills, I know you need athletics, and I know you need probably handiness. Not really worried about it right now. <laughs> you got a fine arts degree and you went in the military? Buddy, you did not follow what you should have done. Let's see. And you had... <laughs> Hang on. Are you telling me he's got an A in communications? And... Oh my gosh. He's only got two days. You know what? I could feed him Ambrosia. I could. It wouldn't, it wouldn't reset his age to a young adult, but it would put him back to being an adult and give him a chance to do his lifetime wish. I'm making an executive decision here. <laughs> I think we're going to give Don a second chance. And then, that, well, or should we? No, we shouldn't. No, in fact, though, I should change his job. Um, the communications degree would help him in political big time. He could start that off right away and do a lot better. You know what? He's changing his job. That at least I'm going to do. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Don't do it that way. Don't do it that way. Sorry. I'm about to mess up. Um, going to completely mess up. Let's upload your resume and see what's there. Uh, see what we can come up with. And then that way you won't have to go to work so early. She's all. She's just reacting out of devastation and shock. She doesn't know what's going on. So that's why. All right, you're going to accept this career. And yes, I don't care. There we go. Um, okay, buddy. Now, at this point, why don't you go ahead and go up here and get yourself cleaned up. Go take a shower. And let's see, what do you got? You're not working again. Oh, you are working tomorrow. All right, so you go, ahead, go on to bed. I'll let you share her bed. Uh, let's go ahead and end the date. That was just wrong. Okay, she's hungry. Good. All right, so at least we know what was what's going on. We know where we're headed. Um, we don't have to ask about his partner because we <laughs> got rid of her. <laughs> we did that pretty well. Um, man, it got late pretty quick, didn't it? All right, you, why don't you go ahead and go on up here and take care of yourself. Anderson, um, you're supposed to be eating. What are you doing? Use an umbrella. Go home. I have no idea where you are. I don't know what you're doing, but it's not where you should be. So you go do that. Come on, hopefully here. Go to bed. Um, you're not going to go play the idiots. <laughs> I have a bunch of idiots in my house. You go over here and go to bed. Okay, are you in bed yet? No, you're almost there. Okay. Um, with Lacey, I think what I'm going to do since she really doesn't have to sleep right now. We're going to go ahead and use this. We're going to do a shower. And I think I'm going to have her come out here. And she is going to mourn her husband. Let's see. What else did I have? Do I have anything? I thought I had something for her. Hmm. I guess I don't. Let me check my inventory. I think I might have it in here. Nope, 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 <laughs> no, 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 uh, I got a lot, but I don't have what I want. Okay, well, here's what we're going to do. We are going to make sure that she may be kind of moving too fast, but we're going to fix it. She's not going to actually sleep in the same bed with him. We're being prudish. <laughs> That's okay. We're trying to, we're trying to make her have somewhat of a reputation. Um... Let's see, it's not in here, I guess. Um, outdoor activities, then. Where are you at? It came with Island Paradise, and I know I've seen it a million times and just never get it. Alright, if I can't find it this way, which it's probably right there in front of my face and I can't find it, I'll go through this way. Um, Island Paradise. Where are you? Oh, come on. Seriously? <laughs> I've lost my mind. I can't find anything. 
Ah, I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. Where? There it is. All right. Go ahead and take the tent out. You're going to sleep in the tent tonight. You could sleep in the treehouse, actually, if you're a kid. Um, not you. You. Go ahead and actually place this thing here. And then I'll have you sleep in there tonight. Because you're just not ready to sleep in your own bed. That's it. You're upset about your husband still. You don't want to sleep in your own bed. Let's see, what is Don? Don kind of hit on you because he is a dirt. He's a little bit of a dog. So, yeah, whatever. <laughs> it's just to be expected. I can't believe he's going to be hes going to be an elder by the time she gets married to him. I hate that. Yeah, I can fix it. I'd have to fix it fast. <laughs> I'm not going to, but I could. It's okay. All right, so I think I got everybody set up. Everybody else should be in bed, and um, I'm going to let her go ahead, come down here, do what I'm asking her to do, which is just mourn her husband, and then she can, go, she can go to bed. And tomorrow we will work on, we'll continue the mourning process, which she only has another day to mourn. I don't want to get her married or move any further until this is done. So to me at that point, then she's fair game. Right now, I don't want to do that because that would just be bad. <laughs> it just be wrong. We owe Christopher at least that much. But I did want to get Don in the house just because story progression snatches him up and attaches him to somebody so quickly. And I didn't want to actually have her lose that option. But we are going to throw a funeral for Christopher. Um, I'm imagining it'll be on Saturday or possibly tomorrow. It might be on. It might be today. So maybe may just go ahead and get that done. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Um, when we come back, we got a lot to get taken care of. At least I think. Wait. Are we done? Yes, we did Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. All right, guys, I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching.